And we, we broke off last time with the uh, storyline just being opened up for Yuki Takamiya. So we're going to we're going to keep going here and we don't have any of her chart unlocked. So zero percent is where I like to start it off. Nice new storyline, not getting into somebody else who's like 22 percent of the way done. Just huh. clear and concise. What do we got? She looks rough. I like it. I've also switched to the English voices. They have really good voice actors too. The VA for uh, the English voice actors is a lot better than I thought it was going to be. Initially, I'm usually pretty apprehensive about things like that. Oh. Okay. Oh, no, you want me to follow her? Oh. Yeah, we can go up a little bit more here. told me to grow it out remember that's right you stopped writing back to me i was worried you know yeah sorry a lot of things happened after the move huh but i just got transferred here today's my first day she doesn't even have their really? uniform i knew you went to this school too figured i'd find you eventually it's good to see your face again <laughs> Though, I never took you for a track girl. <laughs> oh, there's so many things I want to talk to you about. Aren't you in the middle of practice right now? Oh. I gotta get somewhere too. But now, we can see each other anytime. He found her. Totally. Keep working hard, Nachan. You know it. Later. If you remember last time, he gave her, the guy in the background obviously, gave her a ride on his motorcycle. And just kept hitting on her, laying it on thick. So, uh, Yuki Chan. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shoe, I'm a Gucci. I don't like being called by my name, but I just heard. I didn't ask your opinion. Shut up. It's fine if it's her. Uh, you remember me, right? Uh, who are you again? Rude. How about the guy you were destined to meet? <laughs> He's trying. I bumped into in the shopping district. He's trying. Don't get all weird about it. Oh, you're so cruel, Yuki-chan. I said quit calling me that. Oh, I was going to give it a thought, but hey, I guess not. Miguchi, I've been looking for you. Uh, Nenji Ogata. Nenji. The hell? Well, well, well. It isn't Takami of Suzu High. What are you doing on our turf? Not trying to stake a claim, are you? She just transferred here, actually. All right, all right. Let's give it a thought so that she can explain to us. I'm pretty sure this is her friend. Childhood yeah, childhood friend. We went our separate ways in middle school, but we still kept writing to each other. She's the only person I really care about. Some flirty rich kid who won't stop following me around. He is a flirty rich kid. He used to be close friends with a gang leader at Sakura. Huh. And then Ninji Ogata. Built up a reputation as a tough guy. All the way back in middle school, actually. Every delinquent around here knows who he is. I mean, that's what the pompadour hair is for, you know? You gotta have that, uh, that look. That style. Also, sorry I keep messing with this little madness thing over here. It's, uh... It weighs the exact amount that my arm can hold. So it ends up like shifting and falling and I have to make sure it's not going to fall anymore. And when I see it, I'm like, ah, oh, crap. You got the wrong uniform on, sweetheart. She is wearing the old the uniform. It's just because that damn four eyes made a mistake. I mean, obviously. Four eyes. I don't want to go around wearing those girly skirts anyhow. Oh, yeah, because they've got shorter skirts and she's got a long one. Seems kind of weird if you ask me. A transfer at this time of year? Maybe that's just how it happened for her. Yeah, you don't know her life. She's trying to pull some shit. Hey, just lay off already. But why'd she come here of all places? 
I hear? Whoa. That feels better. That just feels better. Even if there's a little bit of the table in the back. It feels better. I don't feel like I'm so low. Hiding out down here. Uh oh. I've been waiting for you. You're dismissed. It's never a good thing I to hear. To speak with her alone. All right, what you got, nerd? Yuki Takamiya, 16 years old. She's 16? Oh wow, I thought they were a lot younger than that. Girls high school. Entered a boys' school and engaged multiple delinquents. Punch people. Twelve of which were sent to the hospital. Your reputation proceeds. It had been more, but you know, you know. I went to Nigakuri to settle a score. And somehow the cops managed to sniff me out. One of those dicks must have snitched. Any of those Kuri boys end up dead. Three had bone fractures. The others just bruises and scrapes. They'll be fine. That's too bad. Hmm. Got something to say? They're the ones who laid their filthy hands on my friend. All I did was give them what they had coming. He had it coming. Business anyways. You seem a little tense. It went straight into that one. I didn't even hit anything. The point. We've taken notice of your particular set of skills. That pay the bills. Like yes. Work with you. Seriously? What? <laughs> is he for real right now? What is? By that you mean selling out my friends? Oh wait. I'm not gonna be your stooge, and I don't work with cops. In the other timeline, she was literally working with the uh, father, Hita Takamiya, the men in black. Currently serving a sentence for the murder of a gang member. Yeah. So what? There have been attempts on his life by other inmates. Not surprising, since the man he killed was a gang leader. Yeah. I imagine it's a fair reputation <laughs> for them. Your father has been assaulted twice, but he is alive. For now. For now? Now, if we were so inclined, it would be quite easy to transfer him to a safer facility. Yeah. Contingent on your cooperation, of course. God, I hate you already. But at least it shows that she's like cares for her family. He's behind bars for stabbing a yakuza. Maybe he's nothing but a too big gangster, but he's the only real family I have. Yeah, that's just what I was getting at. Are you familiar with Shikishima Industries? Oh. Publicly, they manufacture a wide range of products. I'm not. No. Rockets, planes, trains, ships, planes, trains, automobiles, John Candy. Not so publicly. It seems they're also developing nuclear weapons. We suspect they are colluding with another nation to do so. Oh, they think they're making what nukes? What does that have to do with me? We began investigating and found that several miners are connected to these weapons. All of these children are of high school age and are being rounded up at a school affiliated with Shikishima. Okay, that makes more sense. Um, let's look at Shikishima Industry Industries. It's that company with all those commercials for TVs and fridges. So they're making weapons too? I was, <laughs> my brain is trying to think of like a Shikishima, like jingle. <laughs> using kids to make nuclear weapons? This shit sounds ridiculous. I think I'm going to, oh, hold on, hold on. I, I learned about this last time. So there's only this and this. So it doesn't matter which one I get, I ask him about, I guess. So let's go with the first one that he gave us. If you bastards got that much dirt on him, why don't you just bust into Shikishima yourself? Yeah. Why do you need another child? We'd prefer not to have this go public. Cause it sounds like they need her the police are involved. or would like to at least have her Wait, ability to punch cops. the crap out of people. A special investigations unit. The men in black. Government you can say established it. and affiliated. Some might call us spies. I am director of the SIU and your superior. Oh, he's already taken command. He's like, this is this is a done deal. She's got no way out. Well, Damn four eyes. 
Ah. Uh, that four eyes. They may not be cops, but they're honestly all the same to me. Weapons and children. It's like the way it says it. At least they're not making children. What do these kids have to do with it? I'm glad to see I've piqued your interest. Take a look at those documents on the table. Take a look at my documents. They're the only ones I got. Not much of some documents. Never seem to do a lot. All right, let's check them. Uh, class 1B, Iori Fuyusaka. Class 2A, Renya Goto. More Class 1, Kisaragi, Karabe. <laughs> class 1C. Natsuno Minami. Minami. We need someone to investigate these students. And that someone is you, Yuki Takamiya. Oh, so not only are her skills, but why her? Her ability to beat people up, but her skills also then become her ability to infiltrate. We went our separate ways, and but we still kept writing to each. Yeah, sorry, I'd already, already seen this one. Uh, who's this? She can also infiltrate. This is Ryoko Shinonome. She is another undercover investigator, and your superior. Just as she did, you'll be transferring to Sakura High School. We'll handle the paperwork. Hey, pump your brakes, you old man. I haven't agreed to any of this shit yet. You will. Ryoko Shinonome. Doesn't look like I can ask her anything related to the fact. And it doesn't look like there's anything sneaky or secretive. No secrets. You have quite the abrasive personality. Right. They got dirt on you too, Dopey. She's more like sleepy. Yes, she is. Hey, I'm talking to you. She doesn't look like she knows much. <laughs> I can already tell I'm not gonna like you. <sighs> you have quite the abrasive personality. Oh. Nothing? No, it doesn't look like I got anything else. No, I've had enough of this. We're not finished. Do you accept your assignment? I don't give a shit about your assignment. Well then. Your assignment. Should you choose to accept it? We're not getting through to her. Don't worry. She will work with us. It's her destiny after all. So they definitely know a lot more than they're letting on as well. The way she sits. I used to sit like this too, though. No, so I can't falter. Where are you, Nachan? I watched Samurai Shampoo in high school and then I sat like Mugen for like a year and a half. That's the other one. You. Nobody here is uh, Juro. Not what I wanted. This is what I wanted. Hey you. Got a sec? Oh, she's the one who likes Juro. Okay. My brain can do this. My brain can do this. This is a poor girl that's in love with anybody. And then there's nothing else. Okay, okay. You're in class 1C. That right? Yes. Does she know about Did you need something or Hey, I'm asking you about stuff. Natsuno Minami. Class, there goes Jiro. Son of a Yeah. She's been out for 3 days now. Have you heard anything? The teacher just said she was out sick. Did they hear from her directly? I don't know. Hmm. Sorry for bothering you. Oh. Oh. She's sad because he's gone already. 
But he went down this way. And then there was another girl. Give me a dollar. Oh, no. Never mind. Miwa-chan. Iyui-chan. Any news? Oh. No one at the school seems to know anything. Sneak in some information. I hope Matsuno-chan's okay. <sighs> what should we do? Stop by Matsuno-chan's house again? Those weird guys might still be there, though. <sighs> Do I go talk to them? Hey, you. <laughs> hey. Not sec. Natsunomi Nami. Natsunomi Nami. Mm, who are you? Oh, there's the other girl. Takamiya, but that's beside the point. I want to know what's going on with Natsuno. Why hasn't she been coming to school? It sounds like she hasn't been at home either. We went to her house yesterday. Oh. But her so she's kind of just hiding out then. For the, intercom. the police were there too. Were they really the police though? Huh. Well, that's worrying. Thanks for letting me know. Only a little troubling. Oh. Sorry, did I keep you waiting? It's okay. Let's get going. Okay, while well, they're going. Been at home either. And those cops, or whatever they are, what were they doing there? I'm glad I got to that before she started talking to me. I'm talking about the cops at Minami's house. I thought they were all my concern. Part of my assignment. Oh, they split it so half and half. Are we clear? Dude, this girl sucks. Hey, you need to punch her in the other arm. Okay, tell her to hold on, but you can't actually like. What could have happened to Nachan? Huh. Oh, he definitely does. To do what I do best. Punch somebody. Call people? I thought it was punch somebody. I gotta, I gotta remember to look down there and look at what year it is. I thought I made it clear that you are not to contact me. I need to know what happened to Natsuno Minami. And I know you have answers. Teenagers run away from home all the time. That's what the police say, but the school insists she's out sick. Looks like nobody can get their story straight. Yeah, right? So which is it, huh? I'm not an idiot, you know. Your suspicions are not unfounded. But our investigation is still ongoing. I don't have a clear answer myself. We don't know where she is, or even if she's still alive. She may be traveling one direction or the other. So far to kidnapping who the hell would want to kidnap her Shikishima? i like the way this guy talks anyone realizing she was gone there'd be no need to draw such attention to themselves no someone else is behind this somebody else and that's who shinonome is looking for <laughs> someone at the school could be behind this it's possible they are there even now and yet here you are. The situation is dangerous. I suggest you keep your nose out of it. Shinonome kun has this under control. Oh, I called it kun. As for you, <laughs> Takamiya kun, you will continue Aye. to monitor the other students as instructed. I don't call me kun. Have I made myself clear? <laughs> Screw that. You should call him four eyes kun. Get him back. Okay, a little bit of TBC to be continued. Healthy amount of upgrading chips. I think the next person we go to is... Oh, what? Uh. Oh, so you can unlock this one. But we want to... 
probably go down the line with Iori, Megumi, Aesaki Gahara. I already did Natsunos. That's how I got Yuki Takamiya, so. Let's actually go to battle for a second. Yeah. Ashtaba City Battle. Four. Difficulty intense. Just the way I like it. Make sure to keep switching people out as much as we can. Okay. I'm going to need like everybody then. Got it. Oh, and then one person's going to end up with uh, an overload. Or I guess I don't have to take that many. Clear defense rate at time of clearing 60% or higher. Clear within 60 seconds. Does it show? It does show. Self-destructive drum mine kaiju will appear. So I would like to have two of you nerds with me. Can I do a recover? Yes. Okay. That that seems a lot better because I'm, I'm going to want one of you nerds here. Probably Miura. Probably Miura. Because they're self-destructive. That means I don't, I'm not going to want to get near a lot of them. And to not get near a lot of them, I'm going to want you two to be very good. Let's actually go to the thing, the meta system, and upgrade this. Yeah, we can do this. And we can also do the multiplier enhancements. Heal the EP or recover EP immediately allows an all allies to take action. Raises shields on all allies for 10 seconds. Doubles their movement speed. I think allowing them to take an extra action is really strong. And then let's break down into all of our units. Um, yes. I want to be able to drop things down from the sky. No, not level up. Equip. I think counter is probably a little bit more fun to have on you. Hey, Seki Gahara, you're not in this fight. Look. I just like being able to hit with you. And you didn't really get a great upgrade in that last one either. So let's upgrade your rocket launchers again. Her sentry gun is what we're upgrading here. She also can get heavy knuckles. No, we're going to do this as well. Ryoko Shinonome is definitely not coming with us. Okay, this girl is. And this girl's mech I like a lot. Her rail gun is really good. Her long range missiles are nice. Anti-air bombardment. High potent missile at a kaiju. Yeah, I like this. That looks good. Lock on range and more power. Yeah, let's do that. And then these three, I like being able to to hit from afar. Oh, that's the EMP. Yeah, we'll give you the anti air bombardment. I'm not going to upgrade that one, though. Just gives me more options is what I'm looking for. I don't think you need stun knuckles. I never get close to anybody with the, these mechs at all. I do think we upgrade your rail gun. And we upgrade your long range missiles. So far, nothing to really upgrade other than... I like the multi-lock. I like the multi-lock and I like the pulse lasers. Is this the one? Yeah, this is the one that ignores armor. Good stuff. This one does more damage than this one does. We've, we've been over that, but it, this one takes energy. And then shield matrix. No, I don't think about shield matrix right now. I think we do upgrade this. 
Yeah, now we're starting to, you know, use a lot more of our points here. And I can see how they could go really, really fast. You already have the EMP attractor. You do not. I think EMP attractor is just really nice. For me personally, I'm going to want to use it whenever I can to bring things down that they can't hit naturally. This thing just takes too long for the wait time. I think one person should have it and the other person should be like, you know, kind of close range, kind of mid range, that kind of fighter. Yeah, I can't get stuck on this. I can't get stuck on this. I will get stuck on doing stuff like that. I guarantee it. Let's just go. May 27th. Drum mine. Of course. Drum mines. They're bombs originally intended for excavation support. Its entire body is filled with RDX. Once the target's within blast range, the whole kaiju detonates. A single drum mine self-destructing could cause incredible damage to our sentinels. And the surrounding area. You know, that sounds like something we might be able to use. True. If we knock them away just before detonation, that could wipe out a whole swarm of kaiju at once their own weapons against them but is it really going to be that easy now you're talking we'll give them a taste of their own damn medicine fair let's beat them up let's I'll stop them. I'll make it work not throwing I keep my spirit. stay calm remember your training he can he can bust them up with the long range missiles we're good here They did not die from that, but they will die from a second salvo. But instead of a second salvo, let's give him the... Let's give him a little bit of... A little bit of column A and a little bit of column B, if you know what I'm talking about. He doesn't have any armor, does he? Hold on. I almost forgot about doing this. Oh god. Okay, it shot him. Get him with the long range. Now we can get him with the rail gun. Both of them? Oh, nice. I don't know if he's, he's going to get much of any uh, stuff done here, especially with these drum mines being all over the place, but... We can try. From above. Okay. What next? I don't see anything above. Number twelve, move. Unbelievable. I'm acting like an amateur. Number twelve, moving out. What do I do? We're gonna drop another sentry gun on the other side. I guess life comes at you fast. And Number then if he needs to jump out, he can jump out. Yeah, they're all over the place here. There's two twin tails in the back. No, there's uh, that and a twin tail in the back. They will definitely get too close to you.
You can only halt movement of so many. The practice round's over. Now I think you fall back. Especially if the other side is going to be the same. Number 12, moving out. Not throwing away my shot. Him and his long range missiles, man. Leave it to me. Gotta keep my head messed this up. Damn, good, you. Did you get him? Nice. Unbelievable. Gonna be okay. I was about to say, old girl here should have. Yeah, the real gun shot of the century, so. Get it. Right. No issue there. You gotta keep moving, buddy. Um, that should be enough to kill one of them. And the explosion killed the other ones around it too. No, 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 no. Yeah, 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 yeah. She doesn't have enough for it. Focus. Gotta do something. Gotta keep I guess life Let's go, Nasuno. Okay, what do you have, young miss? It's only gonna hit one. What are you? Okay, that's the twin tail. I think you smack down the middle here. The launchers are good. But I think you'd rather just hit that man in the back. Any chance possible. I think you want to move down this way. Nope, oh, down this way. Hear me out. Over this way. And try and hit these boys from back here. See if we can't get you not destroyed. Like, he should be fine, right? Because we're going to railgun this bad boy. And even if they go after him, he'll be fine. No, I think you try the cannons. You don't even have. You definitely don't even have it. Yeah, I don't think he's doing too bad. And mind you, bringing melee over here was not a great idea, but. I didn't think we should be okay here. She's got so much. Mm, she can't quite hit both. She can mess them up real bad. Okay. Last little bit, huh? No, you should be able to hit him with the railgun. Both of them with the railgun. That should be it. Yep. I knew it. I could just feel like I was like, hey, this is probably about to be the end of this. So far, pretty easy still.
line back in middle school. Damn it. Hope everyone got out okay. I don't think they did much damage to the city either. There wasn't a lot of fire going around this time. Pijiyama is probably my favorite right now. Are we gonna lose? God damn it. Is any of the city even gonna be left? When it comes to yourself, oh God, Edge Lords, yeah. Here, nobody makes it out alive. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. Tearing this city apart. What else can we do but fight back? Man, this is rough. I didn't even use the meta gauge. I was looking at it and I was like, eh, I'll be fine. I we took zero damage. Oh, I forgot to look at their skills last time. Stuff like Patriot, Gotta Stay Calm, Sprinter, now Natsuno-chan. You know, stuff like that. I forgot to even look at it. First time clear. Rank S. Zero damage taken all over the place. Zero city damage, zero terminal damage, and zero sentinel damage. Yeah, I think just working to keep them away from me was uh, good enough. Do not proceed to the next wave. I think I, I do want to, like, can I look at, no? Huh. Juro Kurabe, 16 year old boy from Sakura High School. He loves B movies and enjoys watching kaiju movie videos every night. Soft spoken, good natured. He feels something off about his everyday life and one day finds himself summoning a real life giant robot for real. So this is just what you've garnered so far. One MP to unseal. I don't know if I should be unsealing stuff yet. Maybe we'll we'll, uh, we'll let the story play out a little bit more and then we might get into stuff like that. For now, I hold on. Let me go back to one of these earlier battles that I uh, S ranked. And let me see if I can look at Like there's sentinel upgrades that we haven't even started to unlock. Increases, attack increases proportional to damage done to the city. So the more they do to us, the more we do to them. The more members on the strike team, the higher all stats increase. Defense and WT recovery speed increases temporarily when Kaiju appear. Okay, so she is definitely meant to put down sentry guns. Move speed increased when not piloting a sentinel. You're not, that's not gonna happen to you that often. I'm sorry to say. If Minami attacks after Miura, attack increases. So they are like a team. Interesting. The less members on the strike team, the higher all stats increase. So I was talking about this last time. You can probably end up taking like four instead of six. That way you're not always uh, blowing out somebody's mind and you get more and more and more points. Interesting. Yeah, and we're back up to you know, do we want to use metal level, whatever, whatever, whatever. Doubles attack of Sentinel support armaments in range for 15 seconds, which is actually a lot of time. It's actually quite a lot of time. And I don't think I'm going to use any points right now because I'm really interested in what all of this is. And it looks like everybody's got the same kind of thing, like Neuralink versus... Um, actuator and whatever those other two are armor and like reactor missile rain meta system level six and meta system level 10 
Oh yeah, we're gonna be switching out their gear for everybody and everybody's gonna be completely different from somebody else. Ashtaba battle, city battle number five. I just can't believe we're already 28% through with this. Like that's crazy to me. All right, Fuyasaka. She's sleep deprived from the nightmares she's been having. She discovers her classmates, Juro Kurabe and Shu Amaguchi have been having the same dreams too. Nineteen eighty-five. Did you see that Usami chat? It was that kitty again. Oh, that cat is the devil. I don't see it. Making deals with them and everything. Must have taken off already. <sighs> oh think about she's thinking about a Sekigahara. Yes. Every day I have strange dreams. They keep me up at night. <sighs> so sleepy. Maybe someone is feeding them. Nobody's feeding the cat. Get out of here. Usami chan sits at the desk in front of mine. She has red glasses, braids, and seems a bit weird, honestly. Oh, come on, rude. She's fine. That kitty. You a chan's my good friend. She's gentle. Kind loves talking about romance, even though she's shy with boys. Sounds about right. Is this the same one I saw at school? I don't know. A lot of cats After look this, like that. You wanted to go to the record store, right? Oh, nice. Yes. You must really want that new Idol Group's album. Well, you know the lead vocalist. You're gonna say he's cute, he aren't you? A bit like Amikuchi kun So what? Jeez. Yikes, woman. I think it's being crushed. About Amiguchi Kun. <laughs> I heard he's not joining the basketball team. Oh no, he's not gonna get Kuroko's basketball. So good at it. Back in grade school, he played soccer. What? But one day he just got bored and quit. Mario Strikers. You guys knew each other back then? Yeah, in fourth grade. Nachan too. We were in the same class. So maybe she knows the oh, other see. girl too. Now where were we? Going to the record store. Maybe, but come on. Have you seen how the guys react when Morimura walks in? Let's just say they're not looking at her eyes. They're definitely not looking at her eyes. And I can sort of understand. Are you sending your love letter, Miwa-chan? I don't know. My fortune said bad luck this week, so... Your fortune always says bad luck. Give it a chance. Do a dance. Confessions take a lot of courage, huh? Yuri-chan. Uh, sorry, sorry. Go men, go men. You should get a four-leaf clover, Yuri-chan. Huh? It's a love charm. I saw it in a magazine. I thought it was just a good luck charm. Include it in a love letter to your crush. Your wish will come true. Why don't you do it? Uh-huh. And what was it last week? Put a photo of your crush inside your pillow? That way you crush them when you fall asleep. Let's see. Now where were we? Hmm. As for guys I like, I think Amiguchi comes handsome. You. Where are you going, big man? You've been walking on the street back and forth. Than a cookie pan. You've got a strange taste in men, Miwako. Romance aside, I'm still hungry. Let's get more treats. Oh man. You're not even thinking food, you're thinking. Should we go? Oh crap. No, we're good. I'd love to go back to that one place. Their stuff was pretty good. Let's get sweets. It's a hot day today. Why don't we get soft serve? Nah. I'd rather have crepes. 
Let's let Yuri chan decide. Ah, oh, crap. Uh oh. I knew it. Soft serve versus crepes. Well, if it is hot outside. Yeah, I go after We've soft serve. A lot lately. So I agree with me with Chan. Yeah, okay. Ha! All right, Two against go. one. Like little elves or something. They look like Link's hat from freaking Legend of Zelda, dude. We all got the new flavor. Diminished cap. Vanilla, right? It was either this or chocolate mint. All right. We didn't want to pay for two shades of color for this ice cream, so we just gave them all vanilla. You're the one who wanted it, Miwako. Eat it. There we go. You know what my lucky item is this week? Uh, four leaf cloak. Oh, it's a four, it's soft serve. Okay, that's good. Guess things are looking up for you then. In before she gets hit by a car. I can tell. Just so many red flags right there, woman. I'd love to go back to that one place. Their stuff was pretty good. At this point, we've hit up most restaurants in town. Um, do you think we'll put on weight? Uh, we did just eat a lot of sugar. Not that much. Yori, are you on a diet? Is that crush getting to your head? Don't tell me. You two are taking things to the next level? It's not like that. Man, all the guys at school suck. Boys, boys, boys. Not even one you might like? Hold on, what's that? Oh, that's just help. Is wonderful, Sami chan Even just watching from afar. Miwa chan You should do it. Send your love letter. That's what I was talking about. Send it. You said your good luck item. It said my luck for this week is bad. Yeah, you just had your lucky item. You got your lucky item today. Yeah, just tell him. Oh, stop. It's so embarrassing. Watching from afar is good enough. But I do envy you, Iori chan You talk to Amiguchi kun like it's no big deal. It's because they've known each you other. Were chatting on lunch break, right? About In dreams. What about? Well, uh. Dreams? And we don't mean the PS4 game. Let's see. Now where were we? Hmm. It's like your heart's wrapped in a warm blanket. Amiguchi kun and Kurabe kun's dreams. They sounded a lot like mine. I wanted to talk to them about it. Maybe we're all connected. Ooh, yeah, recall. Hold on. Yeah, the only thing you can do is recall. It's time for a flashback, flashback, flashback. Karabi kun. Oh, Fuyusaka san. Oh, okay. He's got an okay voice actor. What brings you here? You weren't at your desk, so. I thought I'd check outside. He sounds familiar. Are you waiting for Amiguchi-kun? Well, trying to. More dream talk? I'm sure that's what he'd want to do. But I just want to play games. I thought I'd ask to hang out at his place. You think this is a game? No, I'm just playing. This is like back in the mid 90s, early 2000s, when every anime character had like the same six or eight voice actors. I just feel like his voice is very familiar. I've been thinking. I know we just met here at school, but 
Doesn't feel like it's for the first time. <laughs> Feels now, like the first time. A long time ago. Feels like the um, very I first time. Oh. oh. Shoo. Is here too. Amiguchi kun. Did you have another dream? You guessed it. It was crazy, man. I was in this tank thing with legs. Walking around, beating up monsters. Were you watching some sci-fi B-movie before bed? Maybe he was, maybe he wasn't. Actually, I'm going to give this one a pause real quick. I'm going to go to the restroom and then I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Sorry for the wait. I, uh... <laughs> I had to play with my cat. Look, she's probably really hungry right now. And I was giving her a lot of the little kitty, 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 kitties. All right, Shu, what you got? Been having dreams like that all this time? The whole time? Oh, yeah, especially lately. You too, right, Karabi-kun? Mine was about a UFO. Both of theirs make sense. I using the UFO's transmitter. I have dreams like that all the time. But in my case, I think I'm too easily influenced by movies and stuff. He definitely watches a lot. Why did you come here anyway? Don't tell me you're interested in our dreams. About that. The truth is, I've been having weird dreams too. It seems like they might be related, so I thought I should talk to you guys about it. Oh, Makes yeah? sense. What kind of dreams? Strange dreams. Okay, yeah, I just talk to him. That was you in my dream, Amiguchi kun. What? Oh, it's gonna go into it right now, too. Yeah, let's do it. Sumire Bridge, 2089? The riverbank looks so empty. There's no century tower. This must be before it was built. I went back 16 years. Looks like I'm the only one who made it. Were Jiro and Okinokun unable to escape? This must be around the time I was born. And I'm all alone. Yeah, 16 years prior, right? What am I supposed to do? Hmm. Oh. You know what that is? Whoa. It's Sumire Bridge. Did I make it back? Uh. Hold on! Um... You're Chihiro Morimura, am I right? Who are you? I'm Tetsuya Ida. What? I was sent here by the future you. To the year 2089. They're all gonna have different names. The future me? She asked me to find you on Sumire Bridge 16 years prior. And That's tell you about our battles. We'll defeat them this time for sure. She's also the teacher? It's getting noisy. I don't want to get caught. My brain, dude. Let's get out of here. This game just slaps you with things so hard. Are you just going to leave it here? Don't have much choice. Gonna need it eventually. I'll worry about it later. For now, though, I think it's best you come with me. Before you get shot in the stomach. Huh. Yeah, let's go with... Let's get everybody up to about 20%. I think I'm even okay with Yuki being at 14, but let's get Megumi Yakushiji. Vowed she'd make a deal with the devil if it would bring back Jiro Izumi. Mm. Oh, there's the devil himself. I'm back. 1985. 
Why so tense? It's your Why eyes. so Take serious? Off. Turn off the. Ignoring me, huh? Yep. You must think you're so cool. People notice you're always alone, you know. Huh. Yeah, it's not gonna do anything anyway. How about that, kitty? What do you think about that? Huh. I don't, oh, there we go. Come on, you're always so sensitive. A real high maintenance girl, aren't you? I was trying to say that you're smart. Friends are pointless. They'll all be toast once the end comes. Being alone is the most logical solution. This cat is crazy. You really are an unpleasant cat. He's the devil, dude. <laughs> Be honest. You know you like me. The first time what? you saw me, you were all fluffy, fluffy. What? <laughs> Chasing me around with that dumb look on your face. Uh, that, that's not true. Oh, this cat, dude. It's the rudest, most truest thing anybody's ever said. Right, let's go cat so what did you think about your first time <sighs> did you already forget you know with the gun uh oh and you shooting Renya goto don't say it like that don't go all gooey on the inside now come on you can tell me what was it like shooting that pale arrogant prick what? It felt great, didn't it? My first task after agreeing to the contract. The first witch I sealed. I wonder what happens to them. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right, whenever you're ready. If you're ready, that is. How'd that cat get a gun? Easy for you to say, but actually pointing a gun at someone is just... It's not just a gun, it's a magical gun. Or would you rather it be a magical kitchen knife? Stabby, stabby. I don't want that. You extinguish the evil in the person you shoot. Or if they could, they'd thank you for saving them. Still... Ready or not, here he comes. Now this cat is definitely up to something. Hmm. Yakushiji. Is that who I think it is? It was quite unexpected of you to ask for me. What do you need? Um, well... Is that four eyes? SIU four eyes. Yeah, just hold that out in front of him. Kind of give him a good look. I just wanted to see how things were going. You didn't mean to call me out here to do that. Why didn't you just come to the hangar? I um don't really like looking at that robot too much. I see. Fair. Anyway. We need a password to remove the infection, but it has yet to be found. If you got in the Sentinel right now, you'd likely end up in the same state as Juro. Hmm. You don't say. Achoo! This is insane. I can't just shoot someone. I mean, the future you already said you did, so... It's not like you have another choice. This is insane. I can't just shoot someone. What if you shot him? This isn't I can't just shoot. Huh. Dumbass, don't look over here. <laughs> oh. Just shoot him already. Idiot. Oh. 
this isn't I can't just don't worry we'll find the answer before they arrive and if you don't then we fight with the sentinels as they are that's not gonna we be good possibly win like that maybe so but we cannot do nothing at least Juro has not lost his ability to fight <sighs> I won't let him hurt Juro again. I have a better idea. She didn't even give him a second to react or say anything. Oh no. What have I done? You shot him in the arm. That'll do. Are you sure he's not hurt? He looks he'll like he's hurt. He'll just be a little loopy. How like destroy all humans, loopy, or like. It's called a magical gun for a reason, num nuts. He won't remember. His memories of before and after being shot will be all fuzzy. He won't even remember coming to meet you. Well, we should probably make ourselves scarce now. Wait. Huh. My first task at the first I wonder what happens to them. It's not something I like to think about. And then you immediately reminisced on it, you I know. I did what you asked me to do. What I asked you to do. He looks so you surprised. Shot in the arm from point blank range. I didn't ask you to pull off a stunt like that. It is said shoot him. As it was on some part of his body. It shouldn't matter where I hit him, right? Oh, maybe I chose the wrong person. You definitely did. This one's got no sense of ownership. Your future's looking pretty bleak, kid. Listen, this isn't some idiot child's errand. And yet you asked. Have a contract. Do I need to say it slowly for you? I'll grant your wish. And in exchange, you shoot the witches I tell you to. That was the deal. All you gotta do is shoot them. I don't care where. But this, if you fail... This cat is so weird, dude. Our contract is broken. Oh. I'm like 50-50. you made up your mind about this? Yes. I have. Shoot the cat next. Wait for him to go to sleep. Now, get him. Get him. Shoot him. Shoot him with the cat. Oh, that reminds me. What now? What, Fluffy? Make sure the gun is loaded before you use it again. It's still in your bag, right? We'll go on then. Let's see the magical gun. What should I make for dinner? Yeah, hamburger steak. I think we have some ground beef. I'll make Juro's favorite meal. Time to cook some hamburg steak. Oh. And done. I don't know if we give this cat food. I guess. I'm not gonna be an ass. Here you go. Come on. A little closer. So annoying. How about there? Here. <gasps> He went over to it. This will do. He is a cat. He's eating the cat food. Come on. Make sure the gun is loaded. It's still in your. We'll yeah, yeah, yeah. Then. Gun in the back. Got it. Nothing else in the kitchen. No more feeding the kitty. Can you pet the dog? Twitter. Let me know if you can. This gun. Is it really magical? It's super magic. You Use it on the cat. Put it 
on the floor. Still has enough magical bullets. Good, good. Like an evil villain rubbing his hands know, together. You might need to use this. Good, so good. always make sure it's loaded. You keep calling this thing magical. So why does it have to be a gun? What does it matter? Why can't it be a wand? You'd rather it be a sparkly magical wand. <laughs> I mean What? You want to put on a frilly pink skirt? And wave around your magic stick like some idiot. <laughs> All right, you made your point. Hey, that would have been cool. It's for you to shoot witches. That's why it's a gun. Witches get stitches. Ah oh, hell. He's coming. Well, time's up. We'll discuss the next witch tomorrow. Meet me at school. Oh. I thought I smelled something good. It's the cat food, isn't it? Is that what you smell? Do you smell the cat food? Have you had dinner? I just made some. Would you like to join me? <laughs> no. I won't fall for that again. You can only stay here the rest of this month. Yes, of course. But I did already make this, so... Eat it. It would be a shame to waste it. Mm. Well, I wouldn't want all this to be thrown away. Eat it. <sighs> Fine. I'll eat. Yes! They seem to be doing all right. Oh. Nah. Dude, you don't have to. Passageway. Can I just enter? To hell with this cat? Yo ho 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 fudge him. me to carry this stuff from the old building you know that place is freaking scary at night it's all dark and totally deserted huh I heard some shady people hang out there now interesting uh, Jura. <gasps> do you have a minute karabi kun over here 15 steps this way where nobody can hear us she she's got a scowl on her face you just mentioned it oh yeah i didn't know you were into action movies that one was a masterpiece pretty awesome lucky you that series is really cool she's gonna yeah, throw her bag at the back of his head if you love movies that much, why don't you marry him? You check out this drama series. Oh yeah, never mind. Check out the, check out the drama series. You've never seen it before? You're so interesting, Fuyasaka-san. Oh, she's gonna punch him in the brain. That girl, I hope she turns out to be a witch. Dude, that's so rude. What the f, dude? <laughs> oh, Yakushiji. So, you and that girl. Looks like you two are pretty close. What are you talking about? You're close and she's More pretty. Importantly, why are you talking to me? We'd get expelled if they knew we were living together. That's why we decided not to talk to each other at school. There's gonna be a cat over here, isn't there? Dang old kitties. Making me shoot people. Oh look, he's all passed out. I'm back. Oh. So you're back. Shoot him. Oh, fine. Just walk right on by like you can't see me. Okay. I 
don't know what's up with her walking over there. She just puts the apron on. It's not like she puts it underneath anything else. What should I make for dinner? You made hamburg last time. Let's make grilled mackerel this time. Some fish. I think Juro would like some fish. I'll grill some mackerel. Oh, and simmer some taro. Stab the kitty. You're just gonna start cooking like nothing happened. Nothing happened. You're fine. Like you're more cat than I am. And done. Are right, you gonna eat it? You think you can appease me with that? Well, I'm not gonna not eat it. Ha! I knew it. <laughs> he oh, rolled yeah, over. Could count on a person to wait for them. And oh, I don't know. Actually, tell them what their plans are. Oh. I'm going to be staking out the witch tomorrow. So when school is over, hurry your dumb human legs. And get to the passageway outside the old building. Now repeat it to me. Um, passageway. When school is over, hurry to the old building passageway. Oh yeah, and how about next time you address me? No. Show a little respect and you, sir. Just give him a little. Oh hell. Give him a little punch. He's coming. You didn't even right, get to eat up. any of your stuff. I'll be waiting for you after school. I don't you think he's a good forget. kitty. He doesn't seem to like Juro, which means that he's oh. definitely not good. Hold on, let's get rid of this. I thought I smelled something good. Here, have this cat food. Have you had dinner? I just made some. Would you like to join me? <laughs> no, uh, I won't fall for that again. You, you fell for it yesterday. Here, the rest of this. Yes, of course, but I did already make this, so. It's it literally the same same dialogue. Uh, well. Uh, Thank you. Yep, same. You're evil, kitty, and I'm learning all about it. She doesn't seem impressed with me. I know she's evil. Fine. What do you want, kitty? I'm trying to talk to you this time. You won't let me talk to you this time, kitty? Oh, I'm so mad at you, you dang cat. Get down here. to be seen together why did you stop to talk That's to me then been leaving at different times meeting like this defeats the purpose should we start going together then <sighs> you're missing the point oh Yo. good morning amiguchi good morning <sighs> what's oh. up oh uh, it, it's nothing Nothing at all. Just brushing up on my English conversation. Wow. I'm obviously kidding. Yeah, he's just listening to music. Course. Oh, well, your grades are always so good. It seemed believable. <laughs> you think so? I was wondering, can I come over today? Sure, why not? Great. Yeah, sure, whatever. Oh, right. Gonna swing by the vending machines before class starts. Okay. I'll see you after school. Hey, kitty. That's my arm. Hi. Hello, little kitty. You want to come up here? You want to say hi? Come here. No, you just want to touch my arm? You just want to touch my arm? Is that all it is? Come here. You want to touch my arm and rub my green screen. All right, <laughs> she's just gonna be crazy then. What? I'll say it again. After school, got that. Yeah. There he goes. I know she's getting antsy because of the time. She always gets fed at seven thirty, so she is uh kind of angry. I have to go. Fluffy's waiting for me. I love his name is Fluffy. Now, if only he was like a hairless cat. 
coffee. Nobody here. Did you lure you somebody over here? Here, kitty kitty. The hell are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Son of a bitch, dude. This cat. Huh? But you were just over there. There's like 14 of me. I'm a cat. All right, crazy. Come on, it's time to work. Future cat, past cat. The next witch is inside the old building. He's a boy with short hair. And is wearing a school uniform with no buttons. So I just shoot him and his powers will be sealed, right? Uh-huh. Now there could be one small hiccup. You might end up getting the crap kicked a out of you. Not magical gun, and he might use it on you. That's that gotta be like a pretty big hiccup to me. A Sekigahara? Well, in case you've never been shot before, it hurts. So, so, so the cat's been shot before. That's what I heard. All right, let's go get shot. Everything is still very confusing, but I feel like it is clearing up slowly, bit by bit. Whoa. How badly would it hurt if I were to be shot? It's going to hurt pretty bad. I don't see anybody in there. I don't see anybody in there. I wonder if I were to die, would Juro even cry for me? He doesn't know who you are, lady. I don't see anybody in there. These umbrellas actually look really good. I like these. Not here. I've got nothing but cat hair in my nose. Nothing. <sighs> Not here. That's the only one I can't open. But I guess I did check everywhere. But yourself. Maybe he made a mistake. Maybe you should shoot yourself. Stomping around with your gun out like that? You're not sneaking up on anyone that way. Hey, Sekigahara. That's who I thought it was. Much better than you have. Sector three. You're from back then. So you're the one. You're one of Juro's friends. What are you doing here? It doesn't concern you. I don't think this was your idea. Who are you being used by? I'm fine with being used. It's a cat. If it's for Juro, I'll do whatever I have to. Wait! Can't believe he used one of his shots on that. I know he's got limited ammo. 2025 invasion site Sakura award Juro, where are you? The last place the sentinel was seen. It should be somewhere nearby. <laughs> Is 
There it is. Oh, it's missing an arm. Son of a bee. coming out. You know what this is. Juro. Izumi is what they called him, so, so he's got to know. You're still alive. I'm sorry. I couldn't protect your city. Shh. It doesn't matter. I was so worried about you. help there doesn't seem to be anyone around but they have to still be here somewhere that's what you said I just have to find them wait oh Jiro? sunlight shining down on him too but Juro, you're hurt we need to get help I need you to stay please I don't think there's clones of anybody I think it's more so that like I can't feel my face Why? when I'm with you. Why did you get in that sentinel? You knew this is what would happen. I wanted to protect what was important to you. I wanted to protect you. That just raises further question though. Like, oh, hey, hey, little guy. <laughs> With the H. That she's already lost him once before. For one sentinel to do all this? Unbelievable. Please, you have to help him. The moment you enter the sentinel. You inflict irreversible damage to your brain. Your memory is destroyed. In worst case, you become a husk. <gasps> Just being inside for a few minutes can be fatal. That's why they're in there for seconds. Pain. He fought in there for over two hours. Yeah, you're in there for like 60 it's seconds in a battle. Strength. Too late for him. Are you from the future too? There was a time I fought alongside him. So you're one of his comrades, and yet you won't even try. Please, there must be something you can do. Izumi was a dependable and true ally. I will mourn this loss as well. Different timelines, different futures. Be continued. Yeah, she only has one one straight timeline. Unseal six mystery files. Interesting. Then there's A. Then there's... Yeah, let's do a Sekigahara, and then we can go do another battle because that's pretty much everybody even though we don't have all 13 just yet the man with the gun for now I have to consider my next moves carefully I love this, where they're wearing their ties as headbands and they're drunk together.
The cryptic note is definitely a phone number. Could it be a phone number? It was seven numbers, maybe 10, meaning three area code and seven numbers. But it would have been, it would be different in Japan. Try again later. Oh. Interesting. I should stay near the station where it's crowded. Now, I should sort out my thoughts. The note says four four three six eight five three two one four. Yeah, it's like a phone number password of some sort there's an emblem on it maybe it's a car key oral nm c0204 is printed on the label co204 plastic there's nothing inside as long as it's set to stun it won't kill anybody what if you set it it's to strange. kill why do i know how to use this an outdated transceiver for communication purposes it has a very limited range. Sakura High School, Class 1B. Iori Fuyusaka. She definitely looks familiar. She does. Familiar. Why can't I remember? You ran into her. Details about the dead woman I found. Who is also apparently she the woman you Mori ran into. One. Sakura High School nurse. Sakura High School. Isn't that where the ID card came from? Yep. The note that was included with the files on Morimura. It says, if capture is not possible, then shoot to kill. Did I kill her? Did someone order me to do it? Was it a cat? So I'm from another world? Not even Since another time. It literally myself. says another world. Must have still had my memories when I left it. I also said something about a way to escape this world. Maybe if I find this Fuyusaka person, I'll finally remember something. Come in. Oh. Are you there? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, it's me. The guy who uh, is a guy. Uh, why would I? From somewhere nearby. That's not good. Yeah. Don't be a fool. Oh, I'm behind the pole. I take it you've seen the recording then. Who are you? Just a friend who's trying to help out. A friend? I didn't expect you to be so... thorough. Regardless, you handled the Morimura assignment well. So you're the one who wrote those instructions. I... can't remember anything. Did she shoot you with the other gun? That's exactly why I've contacted you. Listen, it's not safe out there. Don't trust. Good, I'm not gonna trust you. That's where we start. Including you. Yes, that's my thought. <laughs> Better to be too careful than too careless. Otherwise you'll never escape from this world. Escape. In the meantime, just stay put and don't go far. Let's go far. I'll see what I can do about your pursuers. You'll hear from me again soon. Disconnected. Don't trust anyone, huh? He mentioned an escape, like I did in that message to myself. Should I really just wait for him to contact me again? No. He said not to trust anyone, and that includes him. Both the victim and the owner of this ID card. They're from Sakura High School. 
Maybe this female student knows something I don't. Yeah, let's find her. Once day breaks, I'll pay a visit to the school. Back at the front gate where he initially ran into Sounds her. Like school just started. I'm so late. Uh, crap. I need to drop by the track room first. <laughs> I love how it just drops little things like that. Devil cat. Do you want this back? Chihiro Morimura, 31. Sakura High School nurse. Let me just read this in front of you. Hold on. Shikishima's weapon development team. The one I found dead. I haven't seen you in days. I couldn't stop thinking about you. But now, I'm just relieved to see her safe. <laughs> You're creeping on me, woman. It seems like we're close. Very close. But I can't trust anyone. For now, I'll act like I remember her. I want to hear what she has to say first. Here, have your ID card back. Does this belong to you? Oh, that's my student ID. I thought I'd lost it. But I'm glad you were there to find it for me. Thank you. Is this all the years? Belong to you. Pills? No, those aren't mine. Rip. Wait, aren't those the pills you've been taking? Oh, my mistake. These are mine. Uh, what are they for? Are you sick? Sick of taking them. I'm fine. It's nothing to worry about. Let me just keep clutching my head. Yori, was there something you wanted to tell me? Huh? Well, like I said before, I still like you. Even if it is one-sided. <sighs> Not awkward. Not awkward. Okay, get out of here. Get out of here. This is my conversation. Hiro Morimura. She's the school nurse here, right? Huh? Yeah, she is. What about her? <sighs> what if... <sighs> Ever since that day, she hasn't come back to school. Could something have happened? Uh, yes. Which day? The day I heard about Miss Morimura's secret. <sighs> I'm sure she's fine. Morimura's secret. We must accept our fate. Huh? <laughs> That's not good. Oh, you know. Here come the men in black. It's okay. He's gone. Thanks. Just gotta check. Just gotta My check. Class is about to start. Good luck, have fun. What will you do now, Akun? I'm gonna pay a visit to the nurse's office. But those men, won't they be on campus too? <sighs> Why don't you meet me here after school's out? I'll show you where to go. All right. I'll see you later. The cat's also gone. I think they also ran whenever they saw the men in black. We must accept our fate. That's what Chihiro Morimura said. It's hazy, but I think I remember. It's just going to be her saying that and then it's going to fade to black again.
Yikes. 2064. So this is where you've been. Yo, you up here, I eyes. I'd give the area an advanced survey. Quite the view. Worth taking in one last time. You're looking down at her. Right. <laughs> I expect there to be considerable damage. We weren't prepared for them in Sector 1. There was nothing we could do. But not this time. We will fend them off. I certainly hope so. We've managed to prepare 19 Sentinels. And we've had positive results in our battle simulations. That won't mean much if our enemies have evolved. It seems our victory ultimately depends on luck. So let's assume we're met with the worst case scenario. And both of them know each other. If we fail this time, we'll perform another loop. And we'll start over from the very beginning. We'll have a greater chance of success that way. Even if it means leaving this world behind? No. No more running away. If we don't settle this here, then I'm initiating Operation Aegis. So you intend to close the loop then? If you do, no one will be able to leave. At the very least, we'll survive. You expect us to grow old and die in this godforsaken place? When that time comes, we must accept our fate. In any case... Yes. If we win now, we can avoid such an outcome. Then we'll finally be able to leave this world and... Uh, Sekigahara-kun! How long have you been standing there? About an hour. Enjoying the view, as they call it. You know what, let's just talk about this. I don't know who you people are or where you came from. All I know is that I'm gonna shoot you one day. I don't care. Just as long as you can defend my city from the kaiju. Without retreating, that is. You'll be the one in the Sentinel protecting the city. We're counting on you. They don't know each other. Well, I assume you have some questions for me. Tetsuya Ida. I, I just call him Four Eyes. Prefer. If I keep my end of the bargain, then you're going to stop using Ryoko Senpai, right? Please understand, I never had any intention of using her. But I'll try to be more careful going forward. For the Sentinels, you want command over. You require third generation machines, right? Correct. Then I'll update their systems as promised. Though I have to ask, why are you having me do this? Wouldn't it be faster to go directly through Morimura? I believe a shift in the chain of command is in order. And I'd like it to be done without her knowledge. Depending on how the situation unfolds, there's a possibility she may resort to drastic measures. Is that what she was just talking about? Yep. This Operation Aegis? That's right. Close the loop. What are they talking about? Are they planning on abandoning the city? No. I can't let that happen. I need more details on this so-called operation. Operation Aegis. What is its purpose? The enemy's main target is the underground mainframe. Each terminal is equipped with a self-defense protocol. However, the enemy's attacks seem to bypass it. So the moment they strike, we'll hack the terminal. This will activate the defense protocol. The Aegis system. Isn't that a good thing? Aegis Not Rim. exactly. Doing so will render our time machine useless. And that means we can never start over again. What's so bad about that? It doesn't matter as long as we succeed, right? Time will cease to flow in this world. 
when it does, everything will descend into chaos. And in the end, we'll be the only ones left behind in this hellscape. I think that's more of a red herring. We'll have to... We'll have to investigate a little further, obviously, but... <laughs> 